Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Sorry I haven't posted this week, I've been so, so busy and I haven't had time to record anything. But I'm back better than ever. And today, as you may see, I'm doing a review on the Black Panther movie, which, as you could tell, I'm pretty excited about. But before we get on to the review, make sure to head over to my Instagram, which is right here. And when I reach 2,000 followers, I'm going to do a giveaway to so make sure that you share my Instagram with all your friends and make sure to follow and stay tuned for the information about the giveaway. Okay, now on to the video. So, I really enjoyed Black Panther. I think it's amazing because it's the first superhero movie that has a black superhero, which is a big deal in the black community, especially for young children because I grew up on superheroes such as like Iron Man, and um, Captain America, and who else? Who else? The whole, all those two heroes I, I grew up on. So for the young children for, of today, it's good for them to have a superhero that is black and their own, their own colours that they can like idolise and, and look up to which I think is an amazing amazing thing to have another thing that I loved about Black Panther is the cast the cast was amazing especially all these strong women in the cast they were absolutely amazing I loved um Nikia the main warrior oh, I have a picture here she is just such a strong lady she's very strong minded she knows her words, she, she's quite funny as well. And I really enjoyed watching her on screen. I, and all the other cast members, but she was my favourite. Another thing that I also liked about the production of the movie is the way that Black, Black Panther is made. So his origin is through a tribe, which is called... So, the tribe. Oh my god, why can't I find the name of the tribe? Oh no. But anyway, he's from a very, a very tribal background, so to be able to come the Black Panther, you have to go through a, like, a tribal ritual. And I think it's good to show the history of a tribe and how they do their rituals and how... Because rituals still happen in, like, today. So I think it's good to show the young children that these things do happen to people that are still out there that do these things. And I found it very interesting for myself because I don't know an awful lot about tribes. And I found it interesting to see how tribes work and their ritual activities and how they are such a community and they all look after Let's each other. Another tribal. thing that I really liked about that Black Panther is that the villain, who is called Eric Killmonger, he is thought to be the best villain of all time, which I think is amazing. That even though a villain is a bad thing, it's still very well known. Like for instance, the Joker is a villain, but yeah, he's just so well known because of Batman. So, so we have a black superhero and a black villain that are hitting the charts. And one thing that I loved about Eric, he wasn't afraid to say what he wanted to do and it, what he wanted from his tribe. Like, he he kind of went back to find out who he was and to claim his throne, which which is bad, but I also see the good side in it and I see that people do fight for things that they want for and I think it's a good, 
it's a good, um, like, it's a good model to teach kids to not be afraid to fight for what you want, which I think is a good moral. And I think it's important that kids these days know that they shouldn't just give up if they, um, if they don't think that they're worthy of something, they should at least try and provide for it. So I think that's a really good moral that this film is teaching children. Another thing that I really enjoyed about the film is the actual filming of it. So the film of it, the filming of it was done in Africa. So the surroundings and the like backdrops and all the background to all the film were all really beautiful. And I haven't ever been to that part of Africa, so I I liked to see that part of Africa and see what it's like. I really enjoyed also the, I don't know what they call it, like, I guess it's the anim- animation or the, I don't know what they call it, but you know, like the, not the cartoony side, but like the surreal side of it. So all the, all the gadgets and his suit is amazing. Oh my god, I want his suit. Like, I've always wanted either an Iron Man suit or Black Panther suit because I think... Firstly, the Iron Man suit is amazing because you, you can fly and I would love to be able to fly because that's like ultimate freedom. But the Black Panther suit, I love that when when it gets hit by um, anything with power, it retains the um, kinetic energy. So then when it gets hit in the same spot, the kinetic energy hits the other person. So they were basically hitting themselves back, which I think is so funny. And I also love the retractable claws on the um, mitt. I think that's so cool, because he wouldn't want to be part of Hunter. Another thing, actually, the best thing about this film is that... I would say 90% of the cast is black, which will never happen in any other film. And I think this is the ultimate film because it has such a high percentage of black cast members, which is a big deal in the world of actors and in the world of black people and in the world of... Well, in the in the world, it's just a big deal. So, I really recommend that you watch the film. It is amazing. I know that I say amazing a lot, but it was amazing. And I could watch that film over and over again and never get bored of it. It's that good. So, I really do recommend that you go and watch it. And, yeah, I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And also stay tuned to hear about the giveaway that I'll be doing soon. Um, is there anything else? Hmm. I think that's it. So I'll see you in the next video. And have a good day.